you know, so I flew three pods down to Miami, right? And one of the pods, I said, yo, that's my chick. Don't, you know, the other two, you can have them, but the one, that's my main. So next thing I know, bro, I couldn't find Walter. Where's Walter? I go in the room and he's bunker bustering her. And I'm like, bro, what are you doing? And she's like, yo, bro, I don't know, bro. It, it just happened, bro. Nah, bro, I'm exposing you today, bro. You, I flew out to Miami, bro. I brought bearing gifts. I brought you merch. And then how do you repay me? By smashing my pog? I'm airing you out, Walter. That's facts. First nigga with the hatchback. I'm a trendsetter. Trendsetter. TV 84. I'm your gracious host, Solomon Jones. Today, we're going to take a look at Fresh Prince CEO talking to Grand Cardone, a multimillionaire, possibly billionaire, I heard. And uh, I guess this is a reality show where he wanted to be a salesman. So let's take a look and see what's going on. Walter, you want to sell yourself or sell the water? Myself. Sell the water. Sell the water? Sell the water. That isn't how it's a value of me, sir. Sell the water. Okay, sir, this, this water here, um, I wouldn't sell it over me. However, since you asked me, I will. Uh, this water here is very good for you. has a lot of nutrients in it as well. However, at the same time, this water can be or not be important to you. You know anything about bees? Not particularly, sir. I just bought this property in Nashville, and bees are swarming the property, creating honey. Honey's running down the post at the office. And they wrote me and said, hey, we have a serious problem with honeybees. And then they didn't tell me what the solution is. What can you do for me, man? I can do a number of things. You sound like a robot. Dude, when you talk to me. Can you move sales, Jared? No. You look like a good guy, but everybody in here has been a good guy so far, except for the first two people I cut this morning that were probably criminals. Now might be a good time to try to save yourself. Yes, I mean, sir. a bee makes more sounds than you do right now. Okay, currently, sir, I am developing my skills in sales. However... We did a personality profile on you. Walter needs help with problem solving. What do I do about those bees? First, we need to research how to get rid of bees. And, sec and secondly, in he says that he exudes ego strength and self confidence. Hmm. Do you see it? How much money did you make last month? Hundred and twenty dollars. Thirty dollars a week is what you made last last month. Yes, sir. How much money did you I mean, make? If you go to McDonald's would, three times, you're would, broke. I doing the ten x rule, I really would like to make hundred thousand. Yeah. My no. go Why hundred thousand, no. dude? Done. I get paid. You don't have whatever it takes. Not okay. this team. Okay. Thank you. Good luck to you. All right. Thank you. Okay. Good luck to you, man. This is what every company in America is going through. We get worn out looking at resumes, so we end up hiring Walter. And then nobody's... Okay, so what do I think of this, right? First, you guys got to look at the setting. The setting is you're talking to Grant Cardone, who's a very successful businessman. And there are cameras there, and you're trying to get a job. And he's trying to... And you have to sell him something within 60 seconds. Now... It's easy to do it in hindsight. So I could show you the Perrier and be like, sir, the human body is composed of 70% of water. We need water to survive. You can go without food for about a, a, a week. However, if you have water, wait, okay, see, I already messed up. I already messed up because you can't go without water for a week. However, you can go without food for a month if you drink water, right? Sell me this pen solo, sir. This pen is one of a kind. If you're in front of Warren Buffett, it has a matic genomic trick type of hand stencil pencil lencil writing that is only by... Okay, see? You see? It's easy to flub, right? And one thing about being a salesman is, and I was never the best salesman, is you have to be able to think on your feet very quickly. This is one of the reasons why... Uh, when I used to be a freestyle battler, right, rap battling, I always used to, we used to battle rap. And then I would always say, yo, throw me a word. And somebody would throw a word. So, for example, let's say somebody says phone. I got the phone. About to call Jerome. He's got some pogs. They're going to come through the bone. And I'm going to throw it in the back. Let her know where it's at. Afterwards, count my watch and get a stack. That didn't even make sense. But you guys get the point. So it's about thinking quick on your feet, right? But I look at this in, in a different way. 
Because because a lot of people want to say, oh, this guy, he's not good. I mean, and and you know what what happened? Because he was fit. He's always been fresh, but he he was fit. But I look at it as a different way. And let me explain. When you watch the end, hold on. Let me pull it back to the end. I want I want to watch that real quick. Pay attention. If you go to McDonald's went, three times, you're broke. How doing much? the 10x rule, I really would like to make 100,000. Yeah. My no, go why 100,000, no. dude? Shh, done. I get paid. You don't have whatever it takes. Not okay. this team. Okay, thank you. Good luck to you, all right? Thank you. Okay. Good luck to you, man. This is what every company... Look, look at... Look at... This is what I want to pay attention of. Notice how he's shaking their hand, and then he walks away, right? He's not crying. He's not whining. He's making $30 a week. He wants to make 100000 They say, you don't have what it takes not to be on that team. So, you know, Walter figured out, okay, if I don't have what it takes to be on your team, then I'll be on my team. When I met Walter in Miami in 2020 in January, he was asking me questions about YouTube regarding analytics. What's more important, views or watch time? What are the my best type of videos that get the most traction? What is the ratio of men to women, the, the breakdown of the audiences? He was asking me questions that veteran YouTubers don't even ask me. And this was before he started a YouTube channel. And I knew right away, and I Walter will tell you this, Shout out to Fresh Prince CEO. The questions that he was asking me, I, I looked at the guy and with what he wanted to do, this was before he even met Myron Gaines, before I even knew about Myron Gaines, right? Because he was doing a YouTube channel then. But I knew with the questions that he was asking me and the plan that he had, that he was going to get 100,000 subs. And now if you look at Fresh and Fit, they're about, you know, 385 probably will hit a half a million by Q1 next year, right? I mean, even with all the controversy that they're facing. But what am I saying with this? You're seeing a guy who made $30 a week, now chilling with TJ Millionaire, TJ Millionaire Mentor, right? Look at this. And I know a lot of um, people are wondering about the pod story that I posted in the beginning. That was cap. That was clickbait, just to get you guys to watch. But what I'm saying is this, anything is possible if you put your mind to it. You can achieve anything. Don't let people discourage you out of your dreams or your goals. You can make it. You can make it. You just have to believe in yourself. And Walter always had that. That's facts. Anyway, guys, follow me on Instagram at SoloTV84 to see exclusive content that's not YouTube friendly, interviews, all that, www.patrion.com slash SoloTV84. That's www.patreon.com slash solotv84. On Instagram, solotv84. It's your boy Jones, and I'm out. Peace. Dom, the Monko, Monko, the Monko.